Tens of thousands flock to Hampton Beach on a hot day, lifeguards watching the water as well as issues on shore. A mother recently asking for help with something they can't recall seeing, at least not in a very long time, a needle stuck in a girl's foot. We re removed it, we cleaned her, her uh, puncture wound as best we could and we advised her to see uh, professional help on this. They've found four needles on the northern end of the main beach this season. That's as many as in the last five years combined. It is an area that we will have a lot of debris, flotsam, jetsam, and so forth wash into that corner. And we can't with any certainty say for sure where they came from. Hampton isn't alone. A needle found in Northampton a few months ago prompted the police chief to send out a notice. Unfortunately, these are the times that we're living in uh, with the statewide epidemic that's going on. We all need to be aware and a little bit more cautious. Even first responders directing anyone who gets stuck to see a doctor. It's going to be a, probably a series of testing that a doctor is going to want to provide, something that's going to be beyond our capabilities of EMTs and paramedics. And a reminder that if you see a needle, don't touch it. Instead, call your local police or fire department so they can safely dispose of it. Reporting live from Hampton Beach, Jennifer Compton, WMUR News 9.